The response to that deadly storm, should the county do a better job of working with snowmobile clubs? Two on your side's Rob Hackford has that story for us tonight. When roads were impassable during the blizzard of 2022, snow groomers and snowmobiles wow. were some of the only equipment capable of traversing Erie County. This one driven by Richard McNamara from the Northern Erie Snow Seeker. In three days, I did about 270 miles. With an average speed around 10 miles per hour. At the time, McNamara says he didn't feel heroic. It's just really satisfying helping your neighbors. It really is. But he helped 41 people stuck in cars or cold homes, including this group of nurses he took to Buffalo General during the storm. In the face of college, so tropical storm force winds. Erie County lawmakers recognize the unsung heroes like McNamara and those from multiple clubs. It's not just me, it's all of us. You know, there's 10 clubs, a lot of equipment, a lot of snowmobilers. We like to give back. And address the need for better planning in future storms. Coming up with a better plan for Erie County, and we got to make sure that these individuals that stepped up during this last storm are part of our long term solution. Instead of summoning snowmobiles on Facebook like happened last month, McNamara and David Waples, president of the Erie County Federation of Snowmobile Clubs, says a communication network could help them better coordinate their clubs with local municipalities. A couple of days ago, Erie County Homeland, we worked, met with them. So we're trying to get some uh, programs put together so the next time we're there. So there's a lot more to come. Uh, we made some good progress, but uh, we've got more meetings to go. and and uh, some other information that needs to be gathered. With snowmobile clubs in Boston or Newstead, they say Thursday's appreciation should just be a start. But having helped in other storms like November 2014, McNamara cautions these same things were happening back then, but they did not include future support. I hope this changes this time, because last time we talked for six months and then it just evaporates and they forget about us. Mm -hmm. And then until the next storm. In Buffalo, Rob Hackford, Channel 2 News.